직접 여기 아니까 다른 정원 Almost a Japanese tea house, not quite. We have a traditional Ryuki, Ryuki, uh, okay. It's a famous Ichiban tea house. Uh, yes, yeah, super. So <laughs> Thank you. Rio, 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 right? Rio tea house. There we go. The traditions of Kansai matcha. The, the best Kansai matcha. You must come to Kyoto and enjoy the sweet taste of matcha. Kansai matcha, huh? Kansai tea. <laughs> Kansai, Kansai tea. A tea garden. Tea garden to give the essence of what was historically available at the time to enjoy a moment of relaxation, moment of reflection, moment of um, moment of purpose in life was all part of this very tradition of Japanese tea ceremony. Um, having said that, um, the traditions have been passed down along the way and much of the traditions are being lost along the way. The reason behind all of that is because we are either replicating or we are copying a set of traditions, yes, set of traditions, um, set of um, old traditions, and they have been very much fine-tuned to suit the current set of values or the current set of beliefs, hence it doesn't have the full essence of the tea ceremony inside a tea tea house is that right <laughs> you don't have the hot water boiling no you don't have all of those so the traditions have slowly changed it is all with the electric kettle now huh yeah exactly so that's what i guess yes folks so we are still holding to a particular portion of the tradition yet we're not wholly managing the full emphasis and the experience of a proper and correct tea ceremony. Um, that said, there are special places where you can visit to have the full experience, but that will cost a little bit more. Okay, I'll leave you.